two roundabouts in Sarasota are causing some safety concerns. The police department says one of the biggest issues is people not knowing how to maneuver through them properly. Eight on your side, Sarasota Bureau reporter Allison Henning shows us what drivers need to know. Officers with the traffic unit tell me they spend time at these roundabouts every single day. As you can see, there's a lot going on out here with construction still underway. That's why officers say it is key to stay under the posted speed limit to make it through safely. Driving along US 41 in Sarasota, you're bound to see orange barrels, barricades, and roundabouts. Two of them opened up to traffic back in April, one at 10th and another at 14th Street. Since then, safety has been a growing concern. It's scary. Nick Matase works at the reserve and tells me he sees close calls almost every day. Watch people almost get hit so frequently, I can't even, I can't even put it into words and uh, yeah, I'm scared. I'm scared for, for, you know, when someone gets hit. Sarasota police tell us since the two traffic circles opened, they've written 42 citations and given 40 warnings, many for people failing to yield. People will just fly through, and if you're there, you know, it's pretty much up to you um, to, to save yourself. Because even if you have the right of way, they'll still hit you, which is terrifying. Since April, police say there have been eight crashes at the two roundabouts, two with injuries. Officer Jason Frank with the traffic unit tells Aid on Your Side education continues to be a top priority. If you're in the roundabout, you have the right of way. If you're entering the roundabout, you yield to the person inside the roundabout. There are two more roundabouts planned for this small stretch of US 41. The city tells me the one at Fruitville Road is set to open this fall. In Sarasota, Allison Henning, 8 on your side.